Loved ones of Shannon Hyatt still working to come to terms with her violent death nearly a year ago. Her family says she loved life and loved people. They wanted to show her killer in court the impact she made and the unforgivable pain that he caused. Please be seated. Family and friends of Shannon Hyatt packing a Franklin County courtroom Thursday. A show of unity, sending a message to her admitted killer, Chance Donahoe. Donahoe pleading guilty to the August 2023 stabbing death of Hyatt. His reasoning? Investigators say he thought the young woman was seeing someone else. In court, loved ones with emotional victim impact statements detailing what Hyatt meant to them and what Donahoe took away. I want to see the full power of the law at work in the form of a full life sentence without parole. I can talk all day about her accomplishments, how smart, beautiful, and thoughtful she was. What I cannot talk about is how devastating this has been on me and my family. The judge in the case describing the enormity of Donahoe's crimes before sentencing him to life with the possibility of parole after 31 years. The family and friends of Shannon, I'm truly sorry for all the pain I've caused you. I wish I could take it back. I hope that the verdict reached today serves justice for the loss I have put you through led away to begin serving that time immediately. Hyatt's family says they are not sure if they will ever find closure, but this is one step towards healing an unimaginable heartbreak. On your side, Rodney Dunnigan, ABC 6 News.